The calendar conditional formatting is used to color or place emphasis on specific appointments and or meetings. For example, if I want these golf games to be popping out or stand out in a different color, like let's say yellow, I can apply conditional formatting to that, that any appointment that has golfing in it, mark it yellow. To do that, come up here and click on the Edit menu and go down to Automatic Formatting. Click on the Add button, and then down below in the name, let's go ahead and type in Golf. Click on the color drop-down arrow, let's give it yellow, and then the condition, click on the Condition button. We're looking for words, or more specifically, anything that contains golf. Click OK, click OK, and there we go, two of them highlighted in golf. So anytime I see that popping out at me, yellow, yellow means good, being out in the sun and golfing. Another way of using your conditional formatting is to be able to color meetings that are organized by your partner. So anytime you have a meeting with your partner, you want to make sure that that stands out. Let's go ahead and color those red. To do that, again, it's up in the Edit menu down to Automatic Formatting, click on Add, and we'll call this Software Setup. We usually set up most of our clients on the uh, medical billing software online, and the color I would like to give it is something that stands out like red. And the condition, let me click on the Condition button, are the words that I'm searching for are Software, and if it's organized by Carry. I'm going to go ahead and double click on Carry, click OK, click OK, click OK again, and there we go. This uh, appointment pops out because it was organized by Carrie and it has the keyword or the criteria software in it. Go ahead and double click to open it up to verify. It was organized by Carrie and again it has software somewhere within the subject or within the body of the appointment. I'm going to go ahead and close out and of course if you need to make any changes to any of this, again edit to automatic formatting and then go ahead and Select the rule that you want to change the condition for, or if you're done with it, go ahead and select it and hit delete and click OK and the color is removed.